It's believed that Lisa Marie Presley is Elvis Presley's only child, but the late start might be had a son too. The man, who claims to be Elvis' son, never knew his biological parents. Elvis Presley Sr. met Priscilla Presley in 1959 while partying at his German home. The couple was married in Las Vegas on May 1, 1967, before finding out that they expected their first child together. On February 1, 1968, Elvis Sr.'s only registered child, Lisa Marie Presley, was born. Sadly, the famous singer and Priscilla separated in 1972 after six years of marriage before their divorce was finalized the following year. The former couple remained close until Elvis Sr. passed away from a heart attack on August 16, 1977, when Lisa was only nine. Speaking to The Guardian in December 2012, Priscilla confessed that her family's lives changed when her ex-husband died. She had to move to Italy with their daughter to evade the media's attention. Moving away didn't help much because soon after Elvis Sr.'s death, rumors about his infidelities and love for children started going around in the media. One of the people who claim he's Elvis Sr. S. Illegitimate Child is a performer who goes by the name Elvis Aaron Presley Jr. According to Express, there were no DNA test results that confirmed Philip Stanick's allegations. Elvis Jr.'s website claims the late musician wasn't aware of his birth in Gary, Indiana, on December 24, 1961. He said he was born out of a relationship between his actress mother, Angelique Dolores Pettyjohn, and Elvis Sr. Pettyjohn allegedly met the star when she was a young actress who appeared as an extra in the film Blue Hawaii. Elvis Sr. made the movie in 1961, where he starred alongside actresses Angela Lansbury and Joan Blackman. Besides Elvis Jr., two more people have come forward to claim the singer as their father. Desiree Presley came into the spotlight after her mother, Lucy de Barbin, wrote a book, Are You Lonesome Tonight? Alleging Shedd had a 24-year affair with Elvis Sr. Deborah Presley also claimed her mother met the king of rock and roll in the 1950s before becoming her biological father. In 1989, she went to court and tried to be named a co-heir in his fortune. Unfortunately, her wish was not granted, and Lisa remains the only legal heir. None of the two women have managed to bring DNA proof or have been accepted by Elvis Sr.'s family. Elvis Jr. has to be the primary alleged illegitimate child that was well known. According to him, Colonel Tom Parker, Elvis Sr.'s manager, was scared that if his client married Petty John and the knowledge of his out of wedlock child came out, it would damage the star's reputation. Parker reportedly anticipated that such news would damage Elvis Sr.'s fame and affect his wealth. Elvis Jr. said the manager put a lot of pressure on his mother to abort him instead. However, Petty John wasn't going to abort her baby, but she did agree to deliver him in secret to protect the singer's image. Elvis Jr. claimed he was adopted by a circus family, where he started performing as a clown from age five. He alleged that he only found out about his adoption and biological parents when he was 21. On January 21, 1985, Elvis Jr. applied to be legally named Elvis Aaron Presley Jr. by the U.S. federal court system and now uses the name as his alleged father's impersonator and singer. Despite not having a DNA test as proof of his paternity in 1999, Dolores Fuller, Elvis Sr.'s top songwriter, said she thought Elvis Jr. was 90% sure the boy was the singer's child. She confirmed that the late star might have had several affairs. For his part, Elvis Jr. presented his driver's license and passport, both confirming his legal name. He also has a personal letter from Parker that read in part, Your father would be proud. Elvis Jr. showed off his humble side when asked why he hadn't fought for part of his alleged late father's fortune. He revealed that he didn't see why he would want to take away something that belonged to someone else meaning Lisa, after all these years. Elvis Sr.'s cousin Billy Smith, who grew up at Graceland with him, 
and his children have addressed the late singer's infidelity rumors. Danny and Joey Smith discussed the matter during an appearance on the Memphis Mafia Kid YouTube channel. Joey explained that they weren't opening up to insult or hurt anyone, nor were their intentions to step on anyone's toes. He said he believed the late musician had only one child, Lisa. However, the star's second cousin admitted that it was probably true that Elvis Sr. slept with many different women. Although, Joey noted that it would be easy to prove paternity with the current technology if they wanted. Lisa got married for the first time in 1998 to fellow musician Danny Keough, but they divorced in 1994. While married, the couple welcomed two children daughter, Riley Keough, in 1989, and son Benjamin Keough, in 1992. Sadly, Benjamin passed away on July 12, 2020, from a self-inflicted gunshot wound. In 1994, Priscilla's child tied the knot with Michael Jackson, and two years later, their marriage was over. Lisa then married Nicolas Cage in 2002 and divorced two years later. Her last and fourth husband was Michael Lockwood, with whom she welcomed twin girls, Harper Vivian Ann and Finley Aaron Love Lockwood, on October 7, 2008, before separating in 2016 and finalizing their divorce in 2021.